It might help if I actually turn my microphone on. <laughs> uh, it wouldn't be a stream if I if I uh, didn't screw something up. So anyway, my name is Michael. Welcome back. It has been a long, long time since I've done a stream. That song was Tub Thumping by Chumba Wumba. Uh, and yeah, it's my gosh. It I have no idea how long it's been. Um, I don't know what, what, when it was exactly the last time I streamed, but right now it's August of 2021. Uh, the world has been grappling with a, an international global pandemic called COVID-19 for the last couple of years. Um, I'm just saying all this because that way if people watch this in the future, because I post my videos on YouTube, they understand a little bit of the context here. Oh, excuse me. So, my plan today is to play this game called Control. Now, the Control is a game that I have heard about quite a lot over the last couple of years, and it's always caught my eye. It looks kind of like, um, it looks almost like a, uh, I'm trying to think of the best way to describe it. It's, it's got like an X-Files theme to it, or like a Fringe for the TV show theme, or a Twilight Zone kind of a thing. One of my friends said apparently it's inspired by, um, some SCP Foundation topics. So I'm not sure exactly what to expect here, but I am looking forward to it. Any game footage I have seen has looked absolutely spectacular. I believe this game came out in 2018, I wanna say? Let me look up the... No, 2020, wow. So this game is just over a year old. August 27th of 2020 is at least when it was published to the Steam store page. Oh, goodness me. So, the plan today is quite simple. I am going to play Control. At some point, I will take a break for food. Um, and then we'll just basically take it one step at a time as ever. Uh, if there are any technical glitches, if my microphone cuts out or something like that, please go ahead and do let me know in the chat because... Uh, as I said, it has been a long, long time since I'm s since I have streamed, and I'm sure I'm going to have forgotten things. But with all that, uh, let's try and jump in. So I I have no idea, but like what this game is about, really. I don't I don't really have a good I don't know what the story is or any of it. So I am going in absolutely blind, and I am happy about that. If you hear any rattling noises like that, it's because I am eating jelly beans. Because jelly beans are amazing. And if you disagree, well, you know. If you disagree, well, there's a neat little button at the top right corner of your screen. It looks like an X. Go ahead and press that. So, I have not even set this game up, like, controls or anything, so I, I have no idea what I'm getting into here. We're going in blind. Uh, mouse sensitivity is usually too high on games, but it's impossible to tell for sure. Oh, interesting. One hit kills. Uh, on enemies or on myself? Jump slash levitate. Okay, it's gonna be one of those. Let's go ahead and make sure that our shift, our, um, crouch and sprint buttons are correct. Good. Is there no sprint? Or, uh, crouch, I mean? Here we go, crouch. Oh. I'm probably gonna want that to be alt. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna make that alt. I'm gonna make this control. <laughs> Ironic, I know. Audio. There we go. Oh, that's clever for people like me who are streaming, but I don't make money off streaming, so I don't care. I haven't changed any of this, so I'm not sure why it's custom. What? 
We're gonna do high. Because I can always drop it if needed. I always turn off motion blur because motion blur is disgusting. I don't know if I want that on or off. I don't have uh, a graphics card that can do ray tracing. Uh, to be fair, I suppose... Ooh. Oh, I suppose... Uh, so this game was released in 2020, right? I have my graphics cards from 2013. So it could get a little bit stuttery. We will have to see. Alright, this all looks good to me. So let's try and launch. The left icon is not visible. Which is the- Oh, there is a left icon! <laughs> Alright, well I guess the default was perfect. Yes, I do want stub- Stub titles! Very cool. I think the last time I streamed, I was playing, um, that Call of Cthulhu game. That was a good game. Fair warning. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that... I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it, and we think that's the whole world. The room. And the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie... What is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's... different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes... I know, it's quiet, I'm sorry. something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Hello? Okay, Anyone? give me a second here. I'm going to increase the volume from the game going to OBS. Let me pull the game up again. Let me pull up audio. That's already maxed. Because it is quite quiet, isn't it? Okay, so there's like a native zoom. <laughs> Let me out! Let me out! A mouse sensitivity is a little... 
little bit high, but not terrible. So I'm just going to honestly drop it to... Uh, I'm going to do 40. You know what? Screw it. 42 for the meme. Mouse sensitivity and aim mode. Interesting. Is that a quarter? The mouse sensitivity is still a little bit high. Let me tweak that. Uh, this is always the worst. It's trying to get the mouse sensitivity just right. That'll work. How do you just walk? Hang on, what was it? L? No, hang on, what was it? Uh, there we go. It was, uh, one of the slashes. I can never remember which is which. Move outerwear, empty pockets, and remove metals, blah blah. Ah, press F to pay respects. Ooh. Wait, zero, zero... Oh, how many you have? Anything smart! <laughs> I like it. Interesting, no smartphones. <clears throat> Any objects considered iconic representations of an archetypal concept? Very interesting. Doors open automatically, that's nice. Multiple building, what is this? Multiple building shifts, okay, so internal lockdown in effect, building lockdown in effect, multiple containment breaches detected, multiple building shifts detected, head of research override, HRA protocol activated. Wow. It's also interesting because so far, I can't really get a grasp on, like, the time period this is supposed to be set in. And you could say, it's like, wow, look at the TVs. Dude, have you ever been in anything government? That shit is, like, if it's from the 1960s, then that facility is brand new. <laughs> oh? Oh, interesting. It's kind of weird. So they just open as you get near them? I guess so. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Wait, does she not work here? Oops. Uh, let's see. Collectibles. There's no way to, like, flip it around and, like, look at the back or anything. I also don't have any sort of a flashlight that looks- Ooh, there's a vaulting mechanic! Oh, I'm okay with that. Can you just sprint forever? It kind of looks like it. There doesn't seem to be any sort of stamina indicator, so... But she already moves quickly enough, so I'm not terribly concerned right now about, um... Well, that's kind of interesting. But wasn't there a strafe up? Oh, okay, if you, uh, right-click, then you automatically can strafe. <laughs> okay, somebody did the painting of the back of the janitor. Dr. Casper Darling. Interesting. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. 
Oh, the stream is choppy. Oh, the stream is really choppy. Oh, that looks rough. Let me, uh... Try and change that a little bit here. We don't need that high. Alright, let's see if that works. I increased the bit rate. So hopefully that helps. Nice toilets. I don't know if it's, uh, cause I'm looking at the stream on my own computer and I'm, I don't know if it's just, I want to make sure it's not just trash, you know? So I'm, I'm looking at the video on my computer and that's what, that's why the pause right now. can't tell if it's just Twitch being shitty, or if it's actually the stream. It says I'm not dropping any frames, so... I mean, the game isn't stuttering on my end. That looks really bad, though. Why does that look so bad? It's like super choppy. I mean, it's not, uh, it's kind of choppy. Let me take a look in here. All right, let's see. I'm looking in my stream settings here. Da -da -da. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to figure out if there's a way to, um... Yeah, it doesn't look like there's really any settings on my Twitch side. So I'm not sure, um... Because OBS looks like it's okay. Unless it's OBS that's the problem? I'm really not sure. Let's see. Nope, I need that. Oh uh, boy, oh boy, oh boy. That's my nearest thing. Wonder if maybe I need to update OBS? I'm, I'm not sure. I guess I'm just gonna have to roll with it and uh, hope for the best. Yeah, I know it's not ideal, but I'm, I'm doing what I can. Immovable ca uh, cart. Zero out of ten. I can kick the trash can around, but I can't kick the cart. Oh, I'll go through the trash can. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Look at that. That's nice. Yep. <laughs> hey, I flipped it back upright. <laughs> uh, I can't get in there. Oh, that's kind of lame. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, golly. I'm, I'm really not sure if the, like, what is causing it to be choppy. I'm going to try and drop the, let's see, I'm going to do a couple things here. 
we're gonna do this to 50. I know this is super exciting, but this is uh, this is the way it goes. I'm already downscaling it. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to figure out why it's kind of chopped up a bit there. I almost wonder if I need to update OBS. Let me, let me take a look here. There's a reason that I have this available. <laughs> this screen right here. Uh, and it's because I tend to have trouble. I made that image a long time ago. It was many moons ago. Alright, let's see. Let me go to Google and look up OBS. Uh, okay, Google OBS. Because it could be, honestly, that it's just wildly out of date. I never updated it since I went up to... Uh, Windows 10 and that's probably not helping. Let's see. I can just check. no updates available. I knew okay um, So here's what's gonna have to happen. I'm gonna need to stop the stream and I need to reinstall OBS <laughs> Oh Goodness gracious. Yeah, it's it is uh, I am currently running version 0 0.659 beta. The latest re release is version 27.1.1. .1 that might be my issue. At the very least, it's probably not helping. So I need to... Um, yeah, I need to get this taken care of here. Let's see. OBS. Da, da, da. So yeah, that's what's going to have to happen is I'm going to have to terminate the stream here and I will be back when I am able to once I am done installing and setting things back up. So I will see you guys as soon as I can. Not sure if this is working. boy okay is this functional okay Ooh, I heard myself come through come through test 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 come through test 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 come okay cool I wanted to make sure also it wasn't gonna like blow out the speakers well, so anyway, yeah, I uh, I think I've got it operational for now. Um, there are some things I'm going to need to tweak and change and whatnot over time, but um, let me let me take a look here. So, oh my goodness, goodness gracious! There we go. Okay. Okay, so this is interesting. So now this new OBS has like a chat window and stuff and I mean, I, I don't... You've just shown, closed a dockable window. Use the view docs. Where the hell is view? What? What? Oh. Oh. Oh, whoa. Wow. Oh, wicked. Sorry, so I, I just... Wow, this is wild, dude. So this new OBS is pretty cool, actually. Okay, okay, I can dig it, I can dig it. And then this can not get docked, I guess? I guess I'll just go fuck myself. Vécu, vécu. 
Um, but wow, yeah, this this new OBS is looking pretty good, honestly. So I, I apologize for the long delay there. Uh, I appreciate your guys' patience. We will have to see if this actually works. Nice, it's not working. Very cool, very cool. Uh, that is not pulling up the game properly, is that? Negative. That's pretty neat. It's supposed to. Wow, that doesn't work at all. Shit. All right, we will try to remove that. We will add in a window capture. Let's do that. Because I tried telling it to do a, wow, I don't want that. Uh, okay, never mind. That also isn't going to work. Oh my gosh, this is... This is beans. Make source visible. Oh, so you can... Any full screen... No, I don't want full any full screen. I want control. Okay, let's see if that does it. Why aren't you working? What is going on? What what am I what am I missing here? What am I missing? Let's see. Let's try that. Any full screen application, and yet it doesn't work. Very cool, thanks. Yeah, how did that fucking stream quality for you guys, huh? Pretty good, huh? I need this to capture country. Why doesn't it work? Okay, what am I not doing right? I, I'm really not sure what I'm not doing right. I mean, I, I don't get it. Whoops, whoops. I'm struggling. Okay, what, what is, what is? Uh, maybe I need to turn off capture cursor. What is hook rate? I don't get it. It's not working. Uh, let me, let me try and honestly, I'm going to try and close the game and then relaunch the game and see if that works. Um, cause I, I, I really don't know what to do right now. Um, nothing seems to be working quite properly and it's, it's frustrating, man. Cause here I just wanted to play a cool game. Oh, oh, it was there for a second. Oh, oh, is it working? Okay, so I just had to close it and reopen it. Ah, oh, for f go figure. All right. Well, you know what? I can I can make this work. All right. Hopefully, it's a little less shit this time. That'd be cool if it wasn't shit. Uh, I have no idea where my latest checkpoint was. I know, right? Great game, huh? Isn't it? I mean, just... It's been, what, five minutes of choppy gameplay and then, uh, 30 minutes of fucking... technical difficulties? It's just the best. 
This is gonna be weirder. Oh, it just completely control. restarted. Neat. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I'm gonna try and skip. Hello? There we go. So, yeah, it just restarted. It's not choppy! Huzzah! Oh, that is, that is fantastic. Okay, so that makes it absolutely worthwhile. Let me, let me listen to what it sounds like. Absolutely worthwhile. Let me, let me listen to what it sounds like. Oh, fan fucking tastic. It's not, it's not too loud. It's, oh, oh, <laughs> oh, you have no idea how satisfying that is. Oh my goodness. That is phenomenal. That is phenomenal. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. My dreams. Oh, that that makes me super fucking happy that it actually works. So it's just because the program was old as fuck. <laughs> Something about using 0 0.65 beta when the release version is version 27. I was uh, <laughs> <laughs> that may or may not be a correlation. It almost looks like doors on the walls there. Now this is where I kind of noticed that the stream got a little bit shitty, so I want to watch and see. I want to make sure it doesn't get shitty. And it looks like it's doing okay. Yeah, the nice toilets. Okay. Yeah, the stream looks like it's doing alright. Not bad. I'm happy about that. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years, I've been looking for them, and they were hiding in plain sight. It's kind of weird you can interact with something. What? Did they just not want to go to the effort of... Protein? Fibers? What? Did the designers not want to go to the effort of just designing a fake chip back? No. No, with a game this good, it... that... Yeah. It has to be intentional. A shark in his, although secure, permission to... following basic co protocol, shoot to kill. Uh, amazing. Well, it already looks good. Like, look at her. Oh, her hair moves. Yeah, that's... That's cool. Animation has come so far. Wait, wait, wait. Did that flag just pop in? I don't know. I thought it did. I kind of feel like she should be just walking through this section because this is the introductory section. You know? Oh, okay, the walk button is a toggle. That's good. Hello, as you should all- as you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We are still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request form R4.E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an, I, an R4, then you'll need to get writ, written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under section 75.2 of the employee manual. If your R4 re requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate... appropriate hey, hey, I'm just having a stroke. Uh, the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Miss Marshall, Mr. Salvador, Mr. Kurtland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. Best, your admin team. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, there's somebody over there. Oh, it's the janitor. I'm just checking for more, uh, things to pick up, to learn. Office is in a bit of a disarray. Hello? Is he gonna be some sort of a fucking monster? Like, is he gonna turn around and just giant tentacles? Just like, oh, it's one of those games. Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. The janitor, by the way. You will work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they do. Relevant. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hollowed. What? <laughs> We've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No wait, wait, wait. Face. Did he just hear her That's inner sad. dialogue? I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Did did he just respond to her own inner dialogue? And she's just not concerned about that at all? Oh wow, hang on, hang on, let me check something. Oh, I thought it was leaving her like footprints in the in the uh mopped floors. Wet floor sign on a car. Wait a minute. Wait, what? Hang on. Wait a second. <laughs> That's well done. Oh, it's pitch black over here. Wait. Okay, that's kind of trippy. In a good way, but like... If the elevator was there when I came through that hallway the first time. I'm coming down here to see if she says anything about the fact that she's like back at the entrance. A little bit of a missed opportunity there in my opinion, but that's okay. Oh, this is where the janitor's picture was. Yeah! Yeah, totally! This is where the janitor's picture was. Interesting. The cell... and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Oh, so far I'm intrigued.
That introduction makes me wonder if they wanted this to be a TV show. Oh, that is us. That was well done. You know Wait, what? what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. That was a really slick, um, like having the elevator doors open like that to, to, to reveal the- That was really good. I'm sorry, that's what I'm nerding out about. I actually couldn't even move the camera in there at first. That was really well done. Why can I knock the- Oh, uh, yeah. That's a funny looking tree. Can I knock into that? Can I knock this thing? Oh, man. I wonder if there's going to be some like. Hmm? That's the same warning signs we saw earlier. Proved terminology. Oh, wow. Uh, while pending any notifications of death related to the Willow AWE, please adhere to the following guidelines. Uh, words, phrases to use in the service of his or her country, regret, proud and pride will be remembered. Words, phrases to avoid, Alaska, scissors, blood slash bleed, loss, apologies slash sorry. Interesting. Oh, it's that thing making the siren noise, isn't it? Okay, so I need to find an access badge. Just fucking haphazardly throw. What the hell kind of lighting is this? What? 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 Why would you do this? This is so. Oh. Uh. <laughs> it's so inefficient. Barbara, I am not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day. For the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Sincerely, Trench. Oh. Uh huh. Investigate the noise. What is this? Looks like there's nothing for me in here. Investigate the noise with nothing to defend yourself or anything. Shit. Ah, now I'm shit, gonna get a gun. Shit, shit. Director's office toggle map. You Wait, why is it up? like the murder weapon? Really? Oh, the like tunnel-y thing. Something's oh, that's... outside. Oh, was coming here a mistake. Oh, there's like red. Oh. Weird. Okay, so it's gonna get. It's gonna get interesting, this game is. He just fucking killed himself, huh? Damn. Dude, 
<laughs> You've ruined the phone. intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner, and you, <laughs> you're it. Okay, that was interesting. Oh, it's destiny now. This is weird. I have a health bar now, so that's cool. That means there's enemies at some point. What is- oh, that's the gun, isn't it? Um... What the f- What the fuck kind of a melee is that? Holy shit, she's got a fucking force push! What's the blue sparklies? I want the... Damn, dude! Okay, so... I guess I own the gun now. Okay. Now I have a gun. <laughs> Hell fucking yeah! Oh! Oh, you can swap which shoulder you're firing over, that's cool. Come on me, I'm bad at games. Get the fucking headshot! Whoa. Whoa, look at the way the gun comes up. Look at that! That is cool! Watch, watch! It like materializes. That is so cool, man. That's awesome! <laughs> that is fun. Gonna be a bit of a battle here, I'm guessing. Yep. Nope, oh, fuck you. Wow! Right in his... This is the health? <gasps> Shit! Fuck! Does my health regenerate as well? I wasn't paying attention. 
Oh, that's what the blue sparklies are, is health. Okay, okay, very cool, very cool. I like the ducking uh, and like crouch kind of mechanic. That's pretty cool. It's all very fluid too, I gotta say, like, but in, in a... Oh, interesting. Congratulations, Director. Something's coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as Director. Keep the Bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Oh. Is it safe to go? Oh yeah, this is going to be fun. Oh, destruction physics. Oh, this is going to be good. Very cool. Hi, buddy. Gotta make sure. Oh, that's mental. That is... This is gonna be a fun one. That is ah! <laughs> I love it already. Oh my goodness. You just wreck up the place. This is fucking fantastic. Live action? What? You can't let this happen. 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 Huh? You can't let this happen. You stopped it. <laughs> you. Oh, thank you. That was. horror. flashlight or something. Oh, <laughs> oh, you can pop the desks! Oh, that is satisfying. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna be a good one. <gasps> yes. Oh. Oh, this is gonna be a fun game. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be a fun game. <laughs> Woo! 
Oh yeah, I can keep doing this for a while. Wait. What? I do not have clearance level? <laughs> oh, this is fun. Oh my gosh, the destruction physics in this. This is fantastic. Oh, that is delicious. That is such a satisfying noise, too. The hotline. Secure line of communication. Guide us. Reach the hotline. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm enjoying this. Okay, so these are like reinforced or whatever, so your little force push doesn't do dick to them. <laughs> oh, final shot. Hell yeah. So this is just... this interesting what do we got here meeting minutes all right let's see drafting in public facing material while pending the notifications blah 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 blah, blah. okay so it's all the same oh hang on wait 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 I've got stuff I haven't read. Hmm. Piss guard? Piss corrupted security guard. The bureau has many internal security personnel. The hiss was quick to take advantage of this fact. Hiss guards used the standard issue bullpup rifles they carried prior to corruption, while the armored guards ca carry pump action shotguns. They have no observed paranatural abilities, with the exception that certain hiss guards are protected by a shielding of dense hiss resonance, capable of stopping bullets. Interesting. Is this shielding a result of prolonged hiss corruption? Does the hiss mature in organic hosts over time? More data is needed. Did the Hiss target individuals with combat training? Does the Hiss have that level of cognizance? Does it utilize hosts for tasks they are best suited to? Combat trained hosts are reserved for combat? Uh, that's kind of a weird way to phrase that question. Uh, these are all questions for later though, though it is obvious that corrupted individuals retain knowledge on the use of their weapons. Fascinating.
Uh, here we go. The service weapon. No unique procedures required. Uh, description. The object's form is variable. When bound, the object allows para-utilitarians to... censored. This object must only be bound by individuals seeking the role of... The object will uh, determine whether... <coughs> If rejected, the applicant is terminated. This process is dictated by the... Though their criteria is unknown. Background. The object was discovered inside the oldest house, in the room that is now used as the director's office. The popular hypothesis... Many forms throughout history... Mjolnir, Excalibur, Varunastra... All weapons that of their wielders. If objects of power are the convergence of forces based on the collective subconscious, then this may be the original manifestation of that event. If this is the case... Pretty cool. Oh, here we go. <coughs> can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. A side note, remember to cover their connection to the astral plane as well. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Lose and you're well fired. Thank you. I'm Dr. Darling, head of research, Federal Bureau of Control. Interesting. Anyway, I got fucking force powers. Wait a second. Well, I'll be. <laughs> well, if this isn't the fucking best thing ever. Oh, this is satisfying. Yeah, you can tell where I've been because it's all fucking wrecked up. What do we got here? Reminder, if you experience... Reminder, if you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One, search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and <coughs> await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. That's fun. Reminder, if oh. you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One, so oh, wait, the hang on. Any altered items or objects of power. Interesting. Two, Carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, wait for bureau. <laughs> if there are no power in the room, then the supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Well, that is the best. <laughs> and the table's gone. It's a magic trick. You kids want to see magic trick? Ooh, can I set off the sprinklers? You can! Well, that's fantastic! That is just the best. Oh my gosh, this game is... It's fun because it lets you dick around. <laughs> you can tell I've been in here. All the 
plants just go fly. Oh, this is this is terrific. What? Undefined reading? Oh. Wait, what? Weapon mods. Wait, what? Oh, hang on. Oh, here we go. Oh, what is this? Energy renewal. Energy gained from headshots. Interesting. Sure, why not? Okay, so the game is gonna get really fucked, huh? Shelter. There's only one dude in here? Reload efficiency. Ah, you can do one or the other. Well, I'm pretty bad with headshots, so I'm gonna do the reload efficiency just so I have more shots more quickly. Uh, we, Marshall, we checked out the suspected, uh, AWE, what is that, oh, Altered World Event, right? In Duluth. Wasn't anything, just like the house fire before this, and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find a better way to sort the fake Oz from the real thing. Or you need to rotate these field agents off a bit for a bit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch, next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Oh, didn't help this guy, did it? Neat. That does reload more quickly. Cool. Alright, doesn't seem like there's anything else for me in this. What is chant chanting? His life is in your hands? Walt. I'm sorry, I'm just having so much fun with the destruction physics of this. This is just, I mean, this, this is right up my alley, man. This is just tons of fun. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Oh. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. Wait, so are there two of me? It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. So these guys are all fucked. Right? Like, if I kill them, that's... That's not a problem, right? That certainly won't come back to haunt me. Visitor evaluations. How to handle the unscheduled visitors enter the lobby. Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relations. We are powered to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If they do not leave, <laughs> and then ask them these questions. Uh, these questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you here? Are you from New York City or just visiting? How did you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office and that they'll need to leave. If their answers seem, escort them to a private room. There, perform the gunner's psychological assessment. 
if the eh, I clicked off of the game, derp. Uh, if the responses are within the acceptable range of deviance, see the provided scoring sheet, then immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Probably not supposed to be popping these dudes. Urban legends! Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as the modern evolutions of Jung's archetypes. We recognize certain blank, informed by our own blank, and popularized by media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can even be artificially blank in popular culture using blank, our bureau-made anthology television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranormal phenomena contain clear elements of a popularized folklore. Oz that only occur on blank. A pair of scissors that consume human blank through two punctures on the blank. These details, living in the minds of so many, have been given strength through belief. Urban legends are not just stories for children. They are paranormal realities waiting to happen. Refer to file 4-93-6942 for full report. Eight. I'm sorry, I'm just enjoying blowing up everything. With my fucking mind! It is tons of fun. This game is also like, really, like, visually dark. I probably don't want to stand around by that. Oh! Grenade! something to the chair there? I'm sorry, is this lady just warping around a little bit? Well, that was convenient that they stood right in front of each other like that. Oh boy. I might die. Oh, I can fucking spam it. Oh shit, fuck! Fuck! Oh, you lose like little points or whatever if you die, huh? with a control point.
Oh, goodness gracious me. This, uh, this game is going to be, uh, yeah. Oh, it put me all the way back here? That's beans. <clears throat> the hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, it's our enemy. But there's waviness. Come on, spawn the dude so I can just fucking cheese him from up here. Come on, let me be a cheese bastard. It's not gonna let me. That's unfortunate for me. Undefined reading material because I can't read it yet. Is there a way for me to like save now before I spawn that dude or? Recovery, energy boost, all that shit. Good stuff. Cleanse the control point. Oh, this is the control point. Help me fix it. Okay, first though, personal mods. Uh what is this? Energy boost, health recovery. I don't I don't think... I'm gonna do that one because I don't... Th okay, and then assets. What's this? House memory. You do not have a clearance level, so I can't do any of them. Cool. Oh, and it unfucks the building too. Very cool. Outfits? Please talk to me. Oh, interesting. We saw you deal with the compromised agents. I don't I have my gun. I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. 
Yeah, I'm Pope. Emily Pope. Uh, Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. <laughs> Shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. <clears throat> Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you <laughs> yet. Locked A in. janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Control points. Control points are locations that the Bureau has identified as being vital junctions of the oldest house. When the appropriate harmonization devices are arranged around the control point in the blank arrangement, the surrounding area will not experience any unforeseen building shifts. These control points are discovered by blank detection of an un unobstructed ping using the blank within a 37-foot radius. Numerous researchers have attempted to define control points, calling them nerve junctures or blank, or vulnerable spots of the oldest house. The common factor in these theories is that control points are susceptible to an external influence, which allows us to stabilize the oldest house and work more confidently inside it. Theoretically, this technology could be extrapolated to stabilize the oldest house as a whole, but testing has found that certain parts of the building refuse to be blank.
straight up die? I think so, yeah. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Oh, here we go. Um, his corrupted agent. The hiss manifests in human hosts in, in numerous ways. The most common and least intense form is seen in the many corrupted agents floating throughout the bureau. The hiss agents have maintained their human appearance, undergoing no obvious physical transformation. The most notable distinction from an unaffected human is the fact that they levitate. Yeah, that would be kind of obvious. These hiss have di displayed no aggressive behavior. They s only seem interested in vocalizing the strange incantation ad infinitum. Perhaps these vessels are only meant to propagate the hiss corruption, like spores or Wi-Fi boosters. Or are they cocoons, preparing to enter their next stage of evolution? When attacked, his agents disappear, perhaps entering a state of invisibility, or undergoing a transformation into a purely resonant form? Research is ongoing. Ripping it out rips them apart. Jesse, over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. I can't cleanse them, I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell you I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us, or a few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench, the ghost, or whatever he is, he mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type, I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof, this is already it, more than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all.
This game is really well done. Don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. Good luck, Jesse. See you back here once you have the hotline. Thanks, Emily. Very cool. Very cool. It, this game is a lot of fun. And the thing is, I do want to keep playing. However, I also need to... Uh, I, I, I need to... It, it takes so long to get through one section. I'm concerned I wouldn't have realistically enough time to get to the next section. This is a lot of fun. This game is really cool. So far, it's as good or even better than I was expecting it to be. So, um, I'm very satisfied with it, and I absolutely intend to return. Um, my only concern, I suppose, so far is... Uh, uh, not with the game, actually, but just with the technical aspects of it. Uh, I just want to make sure that I... Um, I want to make sure that I uh, have my OBS and everything set up now properly now that it's uh, all different yeah yeah now that it's all different i want to make sure it's uh actually done right i guess my goodness yeah the new obs is kind of weird uh it's not bad but it is interesting for sure. Um, but yeah, I need to go through and uh, get that all tweaked and set properly. Um, it looks like it's doing all right, though. But anyway, yeah, I, uh, I don't know. I had a lot of fun. It was a, it was a good game. Very fun. Very cool. Uh, fantastic concept. Very well done. Uh, the, the thing that really stands out to me so far, my first impressions, uh, the thing that really jumps out at me is the audio design. The, 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 the sound design for this game is phenomenal. It's, they did a great job with the, with the ambient noise in creating and maintaining a bit of a spooky atmosphere without being too spooky, where it's just like, you know, this is bizarre, but not scary yet, you know? Um, it draws you further in. It makes you curious. It makes you wonder. And that's perfect. That seems like exactly what this game is supposed to be doing. So I am very happy with it so far. I'm very glad that I picked it up and I look forward to continuing it. But as for now, as always, thank you for watching. Sorry for your suffering. Take care and I will see you next time.